This video talks about Hess Dormitory at the University of Tennessee, Knoxville, and some of the troubles that are inside it. Disease. Disease. Filthy. 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 Invasive. Terrorist. Gross. 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 Impulsive. Hideous. Infectious. Disgusting. 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 Determined. Resilient. Weed. Crunchy. Crunch. Uh. Uh. Shit. <laughs> Ew. Nasty. Unsanitary. Cockroach. Oh. Hello there. I was just catching up on some Tennessee state law. And uh, did you know that universities have to provide the students with a safe environment that they can live and grow in? It's pretty amazing, but I think there's a few things wrong with this floor. I'm here with Aaron Michael Birchfield. No. All right, well, Aaron, you know, is there anything on this floor that kind of really grinds your gears? Makes uh, you feel unsafe? Anthony, that's a great question. Mm -hmm. I'd definitely go with the, uh, the roach Antarctic. infestation. We got the roach infestation. It's really gotten bad. It's like the black plague. Uh, yeah. Young man, how are you doing? What about you? I want to get some. Well, them damn roaches came again. You heard it from the man himself. Those cockroaches. Get them out the water fountain, please. Describe what a roach is to you in one word. Water fountain. Now, young man, is there anything that really grinds your gears on this floor? The cockroaches in the water fountain. <laughs> cockroaches in the water fountain? Take us to this water fountain. I mean, it's right there. But, uh, come. I, come. We need to fix this problem. Tell me exactly it's where because these of this came right out here. Here. You see these noodles? Cockroaches love water fountain noodles. So what you're saying is the cockroaches came around this where yeah. you drink from? Yeah, right here. I took a drink and, you know, I saw a little cockroach come out right here. That's just absurd. It is. Hi, I'm here today interviewing different people on the floor to see if they've had any problems with these so-called cockroaches. Anthony, what's up? Hey, man. Hi, Anthony Hard. Hello, great to meet you. What's your name? I'm Alex Monkbell. Alex Monkbell. Have you had any problems with these cockroaches on this floor? I have had some issues with these cockroaches. Please share. Well, once when I was taking a shower, I was assaulted. In the shower? Cockroaches, yes. A place where you clean yourself? Yes. Well, can you please tell, tell me more, please? I was showering and it crawled out of the drain and charged me, full on. Did it? It was a real situation. What's up, Alex? Oh, hey, Anthony. What's going hey, on, man? What do you know about cockroaches? Cockroaches? Well, I know they can transport bacteria, viruses such as salmonella, tuberculosis and leprosy. Also, they can live up to one week without a head oh. and two weeks without food. Ugh. Yeah, it's scary, isn't it's it? It's terrifying. They could be on our walls. In fact, they are on our walls. No. They're all over this place. That's disgusting. All over K4. Really? It's not good. It's an infestation. Uh, speaking of infestation, uh, the offspring can produce about 150 a year. Yep. And this is all according to Colorado State University. Now don't get me wrong, we love our college, we love Knoxville, and we love being a part of the Big Orange family. But it just needs to be cleaned up. Just fix the roach problem. That's all we ask. Go Vols.